Hello and welcome to Sigma Excel video tutorials. Today I'll be showing you Bartlett's test, which is similar to the two sample F test, but allows for multiple group comparison of variances. Like the F test, Bartlett's requires that the data from each group be normally distributed, but is more powerful than Levine's test. We'll be using a sample data set found within the Sigma Excel sample data folder called Delivery Times. To open delivery times, click Sigma Excel, Help, Sample Data, and then find the file deliverytimes.xlsx. This file contains continuous data of hotel breakfast delivery times. Deviation time is the deviation around the targeted delivery time in minutes. To run Bartlett's test, click Sigma Excel, Statistical Tools, Equal Variance Tests, Bartlett. Ensure that stack column format is checked. Select Delivery Time Deviation, click Numeric Data Variable Y. Select Floor, and click Group Category X. Clicking OK will provide us with Bartlett's test for equal variance on delivery time deviation. All 10 Anderson Darling test p values are greater than 0 0.05, indicating that all group data are normal. Since the assumption of normality is met, Bartlett's is the appropriate test to use. If any one of the groups have a low p value for normality test, then Levine's test should be used. With the p-value of 0.63, we fail to reject null hypothesis. So we will assume variances are equal. In the context of a process improvement project, we often want to know which groups are significantly different. This can give us important clues to identify opportunities for variance reduction. With a fail to reject null hypothesis, it is unnecessary to review multiple comparison of variances, but we will do so here for demonstration purposes. The default multiple comparison of variances is a matrix of F-test pairwise probabilities. Press F3 or click Recall Sigma Excel dialog to recall the last dialog box. Click Options. Check Display Anom Variances chart. Click OK. And finally, click the Anom Variances Sheet tab to display the Anom chart. The Anom Variances chart visually shows that none of the group standard deviations are significantly different from the grand mean of all the standard deviations. Note that standard deviations are displayed rather than variances for ease of interpretation. This concludes the Bartlett's Test tutorial video. For more videos, go to sigmaxl.com or join us at our YouTube page. Thank you for watching.